What's going on everybody? So I'm back in the video and today's video, I'm doing another top 10 city tweak video for you guys. So if you do enjoy this video, make sure you guys go check out my other ones if you're looking for more city tweaks. So all the tweaks that I mentioned in this video will be down below in the description as well as the sources that you'll need to add to get any of these specific tweaks. Also, I've added timestamps in the description. So if you're not really interested in a tweak that I'm currently talking about, you guys can obviously just skip ahead throughout the video. So the first tweak we have in today's video is called App Library Shortcuts. So this actually gives you an icon on your home screen of the app um, app library shortcut. So it's going to read out to you directly instead of scrolling all the way to the like end of your pages right here. So there's going to be an icon that looks like exactly like this right here. If I can find it, it's called app library. So you guys can see the icon right there. Just tap on it. It's going to redirect you right to your app library. So I don't personally use the app library, um, but this is for anyone who does. So awesome tweak to get called app library shortcut. So the next tweak I have for you guys is called I'm trying to vibe and what this one allows you to do is so when you are removing all your apps from your app switcher and you're playing music from Apple Music or whatever type of app you want to you guys are going to be able to have that app not close out on you. So for example right here I'm playing Spotify music right now I'm going to go to my home screen and I'm going to open up my app switcher and I'm going to clear all my apps and you guys will notice that the Spotify app uh, won't remove and the music will continuously play. So I'm gonna click on cancel or clear and you guys see it removed all my apps but my Spotify app. So you guys can actually choose what app you want uh, this to work on. So if you go to my uh, settings, go to tweaks. So once you do install the tweak, it's called I'm trying to vibe enable it obviously and then you guys can select the apps to blacklist so you, you can do actually do multiple applications so um like you guys saw in the uh example i showed you guys i have the spotify toggled on so this is an awesome tweak if you um remove you any apps from your apps which are accidentally all of them it won't remove that one so this one's called i'm trying to vibe Next tweak for you guys is called Photo Dock, and what this one allows you to do is, you guys see on my dock right now, I just have this random screenshot that I took over like on Twitter, and this is actually replaces the dock background, so you guys can put this to whatever you want. Um, so I couldn't really find a good one, so I just chose a random one, like just the first picture in my photos library. But I did actually see this post on I Download Blog, so credits to them. And you guys see right here, someone actually um, has this wallpaper um, where it has a blue, red. Uh, blue green yellow and red uh, wallpaper and it actually they basically just reorganized their docs um, the apps on their docs to the specific colors and it just actually looks pretty cool so if anyone has this wallpaper let me know um, i really want to use this for my docs so make sure you guys go check out this tweak right here called photo doc the next sticker we have for you guys is called auto unlock x so this is a very useful tweak must have for anyone who has face id feature on their ios device so every single time you guys unlock your phone you have to swipe up and um, it's just really annoying although you have face id but this what this one does is it automatically does it once it detects your face id so if i lock my phone right here it's gonna put it down and you guys can see if i if it catches my face id i don't have to swipe up it's just really useful tweak to get so if we down this tweak right here we go into the tweak itself auto unlock x there's a couple of settings you guys can change right here where you guys can like change the auto retry interval to disable if you have notifications music playing flashlight on so because obviously i know some people obviously want to uh, for example if they're playing music and they want to like change like the volume and it scans your face it's going to be really annoying so you guys can disable that which is awesome so this one's called auto unlock x must have if you have face id the next tweak I have for you guys is called ring percent label and what this one allows you to do is if you use the battery widget that comes with stock ios 14 it actually adds the percentage um, so you guys can obviously tell so i have the apple watch as well as my iphone if you have airpods it'll automatically show that as well so um for example if you don't know how to get the widgets i'm sure you guys real quick just double tap or tap and hold the home screen click on plus and we tap once again search widgets and then you guys can just search for the battery widget so this one comes with stock ios 14 but the tweak is called ring percent label the next sticker for you guys is called delete forever xs and this is a very useful tweak if you have a lot of like just photos screenshots on your photos library because um it's really annoying where you when you delete a photo you have to go to the recent deleted and then clear right away um that can just get really annoying for anyone because it still basically takes up space because sometimes i just delete a photo from my photos library 
and I just will completely forget that it's in the recently deleted section. So once you delete a photo right here, you have this new option right here called permanently delete photo. And then the delete photo is still the original one. It will still go to the recently deleted. So if you want to retrieve it, you're going to be able to. But obviously, if you click on permanently uh, delete photo, it's going to remove it completely from your device without having to go into that uh, specific uh, recently deleted folder. So very useful tweak called delete forever xs next thing i for you guys is called the snowboard race ring extension so what this one allows you to do is I actually made a video on this yesterday is get custom respring logos so um i'm going to show you guys how this tweak works first or like what you guys need so when you do install this tweak you will need snowboard as well as the extension so i'm going to link that video down below in the description so you guys can show you guys how to get that but basically once you have both those ready to go as well as the uh theme of your choice for your respring logo toggle it on make sure you guys go to extensions right here and you enable the respring logo extension that you install within snowboard so once you've done that you go to select theme i have my red uh red snow respring theme right there so if i do a quick respring so i'm gonna back up restart springboard you guys can see we got a custom logo right there so you guys can put whatever you want there's so many themes all around Cydia. uh in the future i will be doing like a top 10 like snowboard um respring themes video for you guys so stay tuned for that the next tweak for you guys is called tap tap flip this is just a very simple tweak i don't know why ios has not added this so if you're trying to uh flip your camera um, from the front to the back of your camera you guys will have to actually click on this every single time you can't just tap on the screen but with this tweak when you have it enabled uh, obviously in the settings application you guys can just double tap right here the screen and it's going to flip that camera right away double tap again it's going to go back so you don't have to click that bottom right hand corner in the butt um, of your camera app it's just so annoying very useful tweak to get called tap tap flip the next tweak I have for you guys is called charge animations and what this one allows you to do is get multiple charge animations pretty self-explanatory of the city of tweak um so i'm gonna show you guys right now what theme i have on what it looks like so if i plug my device to my computer you guys see we have this nice new animation when we charge our device so once you do install this from cydia there are a couple of themes you guys can select from so we can go to tweaks charge animations toggle it on um there is actually it is actually a paid tweak so there is a free trial three day free trial which i'm currently on right now so it's pretty awesome where you guys can just test out the application and then if you want to go purchase it after the three days um bunch of options right here you guys have like the loop if you want um you guys change the background color so that's pretty awesome you don't need that boring black uh pay, uh, wallpaper or background for that and um i'm gonna go over the themes right now so it's not 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 a lot of, to choose from but to preview just click on it click on the play button and you guys can see right here this one kind of wraps around my screen there's like an ios one right there pretty simple watch os i like the apple flower one probably one of my favorite ones but you guys can go through this and select whichever one you want and yeah guys this one's called charge animations so yeah guys that's basically it for this video so i no, this video says top 10 city tweaks. Unfortunately, in today's video is going to be nine. I ran into some issues with the last week that I wanted to show you guys. So fortunately, I just had too many, there's too many bugs with it right now. And I don't want to upload or put it in the video. So make sure you guys drop a like on the video. Hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell. So you guys never miss a video. That's basically it. And I'll see you guys in the next one.